the Dunn Family Farm and they're holding their first ever open house. We're going to speak with Denise Dunn and she's going to tell us a little bit about what's going on today. Good morning, Denise. Good How morning. are you doing? Thanks. Good. Good. Thanks Great. For coming. Not a problem. This is exciting. Thanks. Um, so this is the first time that you held this. Yes. Um, and what made you decide to do it? Well, they have been doing it for 28 years. Um, we are usually just too busy to get involved, so volunteer help is <laughs> tough as well. So. Yeah with the daughter back, um, she said, let's do it, and so we've done it. No corn stand open yet, so we're not busy with that, so we were able, today was a good day to be able to do that. So. Uh, that's wonderful. What have you got planned today? Well, today um, people can take walks down through the hay field, hopefully see the milk cows out grazing. Um, there's a toy tractor, tricycle pedal, obstacle course. Um, there's a hay bale toss that the kids can do. Um, we are also doing a plant your own seed, so we've got some flower seeds and some vegetable seeds so Wonderful. people can plant some vegetables. Um, take those home with them. Um, just tour the barns, got a, like a touch a tractor type thing where the equipment can be seen so people know exactly what goes into what Freddie does every day, <laughs> all day. <laughs> it's a long day for it a is. farmer, isn't it, it? Is. What time does he have to get up? Uh, well, he's usually up and out at the barn about six o'clock in the morning. Six so. in the morning. And yep. how many head of cattle do you have? Uh, we have about a hundred all together. Um, he's milking about 40 right now. The rest are dry cows, cows waiting to have babies, or they're just too young to be pregnant yet. So. Uh, and how much milk do you typically get from this 40 uh, head? They usually average about 60, 70 pounds of milk. Um, goes into a bulk tank into the milk room and then the milk truck picks that milk up every other day. And where does that milk go to? <laughs> well, there's a couple of places it could go to. We are a cooperative um, with Agrimark, so we're actually part owner of that company. Um, they own Cabot Cheese and McAdam Cheese. Um, sometimes the milk will go to a local plant if that local plant needs it. So comes, sometimes the hood plant in Portland will take it, um, or most of it will go down to Lynn, Massachusetts. Oh, that's wonderful. Now people know where to go for their cheeses and milks, <laughs> don't they? <laughs> um, now how many people do you have helping you today? Oh, I have quite a crew today. There's probably about 10 people or so. The son-in-law's parents are here and a brother and some friends. Um, a hired hand and his girlfriend, so we've got a few people that just basically got to watch, keep everybody away from electric fences and manure pits and that type <laughs> of thing, so. Yeah, that probably would not be so yes, good. No. Yeah, nice to have no. a big family, isn't it? Yes, it is. Yeah, and yeah. and do they all live in the area? Um, well, my daughter, we, I have two, we have two daughters. Um, they both live at home. Ashley's in a trailer on the property here. Mary's at home with us, um, then we have a son of our and two grandchildren. Uh, very nice. Yeah. Well, we really hope that you have a successful day and we hope that you'll do this again so that others will have an opportunity to see what goes into milking. I know that you're one of the only dairy farms in the area now, are you? Yeah. Is that correct? We are. Yeah. Uh, we did a couple of interviews with other uh, places and Freddie was counting. He was like, when they started just on Blackberry Hill Road, there were five dairy farms and we're the last one that's actually working right now. So, um, yeah. That's pretty impressive. Yeah. We're really glad you're still here. <laughs> well, he likes doing what he does. So. Yeah. yeah, that's awesome. Well, thank you very much for talking with us today, and uh, we'll take some video around the farm. And
Are you from the area? I'm uh, from Lebanon, Maine, yes. You're from Lebanon. Okay, that's wonderful. Well, we're glad you came out today. Is there something specific that you wanted to see? Oh, I just wanted to take a look at the cows and see the milking process. <laughs> oh, I thought it might be for the cheese. <laughs> yeah, that too. That's not too bad. <laughs> yeah, that is a good thing, isn't it? Well, I thank you for taking a few minutes with Borough Community TV. We Yeah. Fantastic. Yeah. Well, we're so glad that you came out today. Thank you so much. 